Hello, welcome back to Penfold Gaming for another episode of Airport CEO. So if you missed the last episode, we uh, open up this new terminal here and these uh, new stands. Uh, so they are now taking flights as you can see there. Um, so we've also had a request from the Joe Boss gate to be put in place. I do apologize if I've uh, pronounced your name wrong there. But uh, so um, we're going to change one of these. So, so we'll do A1. So... Oh, they can't be uh, so. There we go. So, if there's anyone else that would like to have the name featured uh, as a, a stand or or anything that could be renamed, please uh, leave a comment, and I'm more than uh, welcome to put them in place. Uh, we've also uh, uh, been told to put these uh, holding points back on here, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. Make sure they're the right way. So. There we go. I'm still not sure what happened last time with uh, the flights getting stuck, but uh, anyway, so right, excellent. So they're now back in play. So let's have a look at the flight planner. Uh, it seems to be fairly steady. Right, so we got these. Um, shops and food stalls open last time they've got contracts set up on them that's fine the toilets are in place there um, I wonder if we maybe do some more seating area over here maybe it doesn't seem to be too crowded at the moment so I think we're okay um, I definitely think we need to look at uh, maybe uh, expanding on, on this so Let's have a look then, shall we? So what we'll have to do then is could I fit another one behind this maybe? Or where am I? It's been a while since I've uh, looked at the uh, cargo stuff. Where? Where are we? There we go. Um, so what? These are all the scanners. We haven't got all the scanners. We need another destroyer in bay. No. No. Right, okay, so I have to probably bring the road across here and uh, make this terminal a bit bigger. So let's go ahead and do that now. Uh, so, terminal foundation. I think that should be enough. And then uh, let's get the um, service road in place. Service road, keep it as medium. Do that all the way across there. Excellent. And then we can take this wall down and get some more cargo bays in here. Because as it stands now, we've got lots of gates. So I know we've got all together 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. I think it's 13 that's uh, able to take just commercial and these three are here, GA ones so I've got 13 gates with only three cargo bays in so uh, we're going to look at expanding this area uh, and then we'll open this up a little bit as well and get some uh, more uh, baggage claim area in place up here as well I think because it's going to need to reboot all the way over there anyway, so. Right, so I'll wait for these to come and uh, build this. Um, so I'll just have a quick look around, see if how everything else is going. Now I'm going to put a few seats up here, I think. Let's put some nice uh, sofas on this back wall here. Can we get a two in there? Oh no, the uh, oh, should we put some put some seats as well. And uh, let's do similar over this side. Oops. And 
fix them. Lighting poles, don't want any trees in there, especially not inside. <laughs> so let's see how this is getting on down here. Oh, they're starting on the foundation, excellent. Um, so, all this is going to need to be marked up as a uh, secure area. Oh, a bit of a lag on it. Now, I'll speed the time up, and I do notice um, it does slow it down a hell of a lot. Especially uh, having a large airport now. So, why can't he find... What? Why is he stuck out there? Help me! How has he got stuck out there? Could do with them uh, clippers just to pick him up and move him. <laughs> um, I'm not sure what we can actually, actually do for him, to be fair. I would imagine he would move eventually, but... Uh, I'm not 100% sure on that. So. so, right, we can now demolish this uh, wall here. That's not needed, and we probably can get away with all of this, even though they've not built it yet. So, wait for them to complete that. Good, good. I mean, it's not looking overcrowded. On well, saying that it's just constant flow, isn't it now? But uh, so we'll have to get running all the way across here, um, so they can be next to each other. That's fine. So, right, so pretty much uh, that area is now ready to uh, start putting the cargo stuff in which is good so we'll come back to that shortly and uh, we'll have a look at doing this area up here as well shall we so let's open all this up so keep it all level get that in place excellent Right then, so while that's doing that, let's have a look at it. Um, let's have a look in our dashboard and stuff. See if anything's standing out. Oh, what I've missed. So, emails, no emails, going in data. I've not really had a chance to proper look at this. Um, I've not really analysed it or anything. I'm not sure if it's actually uh, worth uh, looking at, but what we've got in staff data, hide staff. Right. What does that mean? Hired employees against for ten days. Okay. The baggage belt, back conveyor belt system. To measure the tires, vehicle data, incident data. A lot of that's mainly from uh, break broken toilets and, uh, yeah, as, as you can see here, a rhino being broken and stuff. So. Let's have a look at our finances. So what we've got current hour we're making nineteen twenty-three. So okay. The money's coming in steadily. We don't really need to um uh, hire any more staff. I suppose we can fire some and see if there's any better employees out there. Get ones with the uh something like this one here it's not got many green bars we could get rid of them um, vehicles not much really could do that other than iron more operations let's have a look at our job tasks so what we're short on at the bottom here oops why is this still on come on I don't want you why is that not going off go off there we go so let's have a look at this again. 
Hey, what one did this come in, place? Air sign, shuttle bus, belt loader truck. Uh, they must be new. I'm not seeing them before. Oh, they're just. Ah, oh, no wonder I'm under the vehicles. Uh, ah, vehicle. Ah, oh, I'm under the vehicle job task. Ah, that's why I never looked at these. So, service truck. We short by one service truck. Okay. I didn't realise it was a vehicle one. Oh, that's good to know. Huh? Um, so let's get a, what was it, a service truck, wasn't it? Yes, so, uh, uh, star truck. Stair truck. No, we don't need to go there, we need to go in here, don't we? Do we? No. No, oh, yeah, it's a procurement I'm looking for. There we go, right. Um, so, we need one more service truck. Which one should we go for? Service truck. Let's go for this roof, roofless one. Get one of them. So, that will cover that. Oh, I'm saying there's two jobs available now. So, we've got 12 jobs claimed. Wow. So look at employees, lots of janitors, that's always going to be the same, so that's not really an issue. Right, let's go back and have a look at what's happening. Uh, right, so that's now been built, excellent. So we can get rid of this now. Can get rid of this wall as well. Uh, we can do the floor in the same, if I can find the same colour floor. Now is it this one? Or is it that one? It's got to be that one, isn't it? The light wood. Yes, it is. Excellent. So that's now ready. I could uh, get some more check-in uh, desks in place up the top here. And also do uh, some more claim area. So let's first of all, let's get some of these in place, shall we? So, sh uh, sorry, desks, and we want a check in desk. So we've left two between, two gap between each of them. We want to. Right, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, yeah, it's just short, but oh well, it should be okay. If I put them right, they so they're in line with that, yeah, that's fine. It doesn't look like this one's getting used, but oh, it has got some flight schedules, that's fine. Wait till then built, and then we can get the uh, the conveyor belt in place for it. Yeah, it's just getting quite busy. Isn't it? it could do with the faster belt on, to be fair, but there's no way of quickly upgrading it. I don't think it would mean ripping out the old existing one and changing it, and that is going to be a royal ball ache. <laughs> uh, so I don't think I prefer to do that. And I'm not sure if a fast one can go into a slow one. Uh, not really tried that before, so right. Okay, let's wait for the contractors to. Wow, look at all these people down here. Oh, I might need to get some more bus. Um, bus. Sure, that's right. Pl uh, please leave a comment, guys, if uh, anyone's actually used the subway stuff or. How it even works. Enables passengers and employees to travel to your airport by subway. So, Why wow, it's cost a hundred K. So what do I do? Just lay one part of that down? How does it work? Because like once you've laid it, 
what happens then? Because there's no other bits for it. Why is it? What's that entrance meaning? Is that my entrance meaning it needs to be on a path? Structure position not valid. Does it need to be on the road? I don't get it. That's walking down, so let's try it. Let's put it in there. And uh, see what happens if I uh, put a path. Public road? No, nope. want a sidewalk. So if we put this bit here, see what happens. Subway entrance. So, does that just. Is that all you need to do? And then does that just go off? I'm not. 100% sure. We'll soon find out. Okay, these are all now done. So let's look at putting the conveyor belts in place for these. So, uh, da -da -da -da. We're not using the high quality, quality or we're using the underground, uh, sorry, the low quality. Domestic uh, claim, right, okay, yeah. So, O overground, or we're on overground. So I need to pretty much join all this up all the way down into that. And then all these can be joined. Quickly do these. Excellent. Alright, okay. Yeah, they're just using that. That's uh, fair enough then. That's how that works then. <laughs> just lay it and then they just go in and I guess they go off basically. It's like they would normally. Hopefully it's going to cut some of the uh, bus uh, traffic down. Because there is hell of a lot. As you can see down here, guys. <laughs> right. Uh, so. Connect baggage bay. Right, I'm going to leave these as they are at the moment. Because these will go into the new ones over here eventually. I want to get to do them. So let's just do a quick repair of all these. And just go through all the stands. Just making sure these are all okay. So some of them are not really needed to be fair. Uh, let's go do this one. So okay. Um okay. So, as you can see on this gate here, uh, this has been uh, renamed to uh, one of the people that's uh, subscribed and uh, commented. Uh, so, if you'd like to see your name um, on any of these gates, please do the same uh, by showing your support, by liking the video, subscribing, and uh, leaving a comment, and I'll put your name on there. Um, so, have a look at these small ones down here. They're not too bad. So, excellent. Yeah, they're all good. Right then. There, that's all that's been sorted over there. Uh, it's very close to the uh, <laughs> taking off, but, uh, well, I'm sure it's, um, it's okay in the game, so. Right then, guys, um, so I'm pretty much going to leave this video here for today. Uh, so we've done a bit of prep work for the uh, new cargo area, bay, bay area down here, so we'll probably get at least another three or four in down here. Um, and then we're going to have to look at uh, uh, get some more security checkpoints in and destroyers along the bottom here. Uh, so that'll make it a little bit more advanced. And then we're going to have it feed in all the way back over to this new area here. And um, we've also put all these uh, uh, check-in desks which will then feed to these new cargo bays 
and um, we've got a subway in place so that's good and looks to be a lot of passengers using that so that's great so hopefully this will cut this down so so thanks guys uh, so please show your support to, for these videos by liking the, the video subscribing to the channel and I'll see you soon guys and thanks for watching